10 for 18th ranked Wisconsin leading top ranked Penn State. And at 157, Jason Nolf taking on Devin Barr. Nolf, what will end up being a historic career here with the Nittany Lions, but still has a few months left and quickly there with the takedown. Nolf, two-time NCAA champion, three-time All-American, 54 career pins to set the Penn State record formerly held by Zane Rutherford, David Taylor, and Josh Moore. Each of them had 53. And Nolf with his 100th win on Friday as well, a major over number three, Ryan Deacon, 19-7. Just dominant, and I think that's been Jason Nolf's career. Yeah, and this just kind of sums up, especially this year, Deacon number three in the country, and it's pretty much just gonna be uh, Jason Nolf and everybody else in the race to Pittsburgh. Two more for Nolf, the 4-1 lead. Taking on Devin Barr, injured last year. Redshirt freshman wrestled 10 and four in open tournaments, a three-time high school champ in Wisconsin. No fear, kind of just controlling the pace there. Barr tried to roll out, didn't need to, just kind of let him up, and I think that's going to be probably what you're going to see most of Nolf just letting up Barr and taking him down. Nolf in there on the double. And the 6-2 lead. Penn State needing these bonus points here, certainly have the major part of the lineup coming up, so nothing to fear yet, but if they can get a technical decision or a pin here, that would certainly be ideal to get a little closer to Wisconsin here before the next few bouts. Seems like it's been just a methodical approach here for Nolf, a lot of catch and release. The 6-3 lead, still a minute 15 to wrestle in the first. And that's just an interesting thing about Nolf, just one of the most unassuming guys you'll ever see or meet in, in the wrestling room. I mean, a little bit of a squeaky voice, and he just is just a really class a class act and one of the better wrestlers that Kale has ever mentored here. And just to look at this guy, you never expect the dominance that he has on the mat, but he is just one of the most dominant wrestlers you'll ever see. Less than a minute left to wrestle in the first. Nolf with the 6-3 lead, and you know, there's such a difference between Two of Penn State's top wrestlers, Nolf, the quiet, unassuming type, and then Bo Nickel, who's certainly out there, one for the theatrics. Flair for the dramatic there. You see last year when he had the big win in his championship match in the NCAA Finals, one of the more exciting matches, and if there was anyone to have an exciting match to win your, your team an NCAA title, Bo Nickel was the guy to get it done. 8-4 the score, final 20 seconds in the first. Nolf in on the single, stall warning as well, and the takedown, 10-4 in the final 10 seconds. And Nolf not really doing any more than an initial attempt at a tilt to even get something quick going, but for the most part has been given a one look on the bottom and just letting it back up. So 10-4 as the first period comes to a close. And Devin Barr will start down here in the second period. Look at one of these takedowns that Nolf had this period and just gets in really deep in there on the single leg and just drives through. Mentioned Nolf's 54 career pins, the Penn State record. Also nine this season, fifth in the NCAA. Nolf getting around on the single leg there, had the knee in behind, but Barr just able to squeak out. Barr taking a shot of his own there, but not completely 100% on the attempt, and Nolf making him pay. Heavy Nolf. hands here, heating up in the second period. Nolf adds two more. Nolf took a huge swing at the headlock there on Barr, but nearly misses Barr, able to get out there at the last second. In on the ankle. Uses that left leg to lock him up. Really nice ankle pick there. Nothing more than just diving at the ankle, quick snatching it up, being able to work behind. And, and that's one of the things that makes Jason Nolf so effective is his speed and agility on his takedowns. Nolf fit on the left side. Breaking bar right back down here with the escape 14-7. Nolf 
the high single. Turning him in, now he's got Barr in trouble with some swipes. He'll turn out of it, but two for the takedown. Looking for the technical fall here from Nolf, and probably just gonna let him back up here again, but like I said, it gets the quick tilt points, and if he can get him, that's great. If not, he just lets him back up. 10 seconds left now. An 11 point lead for Jason Nolf. Riding time near two and a half minutes. Crowd there looking for a stall from Barr on the bottom, not doing a whole lot there, just trying to survive to the end of the period. 11 point, we 11 point lead here in 12 if you count the riding time. Look for more of the same here from Nolf on top. Nolf with the quick shot, wrapping around, two more. 12 point lead, quick little throw there as well. Nolf probably gonna try to pull him back in towards the end of the match. So the escape there for Barr, it's 20 to nine. About a minute 20 left to wrestle. Two more for Nolf as they slide off the mat. Another thing with Nolf just doesn't quit there at the end of the at the edge of the mat. Could have let him go to the edge of the mat and kind of reset in the middle, but kept working for the takedown there. And you see, almost had the extra uh, the two the four count on the near fall there, but really aggressive wrestling from Nolf here in this third period. Nolf just coming over top of Bar. Trying to turn him. Got the knee in the side there. Looked like he was trying to get a bar in, but lets him back up and they go after it again. The stall gives Nolf another point. Now the escape, 23 to 10. Looking for the tech here. Gets one more takedown, could secure it. And those five points were big for Penn State. We bring them within one. Right now they trail 10 to four. 30 seconds left here. Nolf in the high single. And the takedown and a tech fall. Jason Nolf, 25 10 the win with just 23 seconds left in the third. But that a big victory, giving Penn State a big five points to make it 10 9. And make things a little closer coming into this 165 match. You no know, Vincenzo Joseph, Mason Manville coming out. Jason Nolf with a big win there, the big tech fall, and Penn State looking to keep churning things out. Look back here, another one of those single legs really just gets high in there on the thigh and almost tried to get something locked up there at the end, but the ref calling it at the 15-point threshold.